Hello, and welcome to my Let's Play on Stardew Valley. This is episode 2. In the last episode, I uh, started my life in Stardew. So, I moved into my farm that was originally my grandpa's, and started meeting people in the town. And now, I am just kind of seeing what to do next. Like, starting out today by watering my crops, and then I don't, I don't really know what. Like, I had that letter in the mail that said that someone came back from a fishing trip. His name was Willie. I'm actually, yeah, I'm gonna go check that out. I know that there are other exits from my farm. Like, there's one coming down here to Marnie's ranch, um, which eventually will lead closer down to the ocean. But I'm just gonna keep going out this way. It's just so much easier right now. I don't have to clear out anything else. Let's see. Oh, there are so many quests for me right now. Let's see. Let's go with to the beach. Let's see. Visit the beach south of town before 5 p.m. So I'm pretty sure doing that will get me my fishing rod, which is very good right now. I actually need my fishing rod to be able to get a lot of different things in this game. And actually, before going down there, I'm gonna check out this, actually, right here. It's, like, there's different quests that we can do. Let's see, trying to keep the art of fishing alive. I'll pay 90 gold to any fisherman who catches three herring. And I get to keep the fish. Okay. So I just accepted the quest. And yes, it says time. So I need to catch three herring. And I'll need a fishing rod first. So I'll be doing that. So if we just keep going, there we go, right down to the beach. And loading in new areas, it's always going to be a little bit slow like that. Eventually the game will speed up as it's rendered everything. Ahoy there, son! Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. Ah, still trying to rewind from the month of bulky thieves. It was a big haul, sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the Ardo fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from our shop once in a while. Ooh, fishing rod. Fish. I received a bamboo pole. And the game's frozen again. There we go. What's he gonna say? There we go. Uh, there's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Oh yeah. My shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. Okay, so he buys the fish. I'm guessing he'll pay more than Louis, than Louis will, something like that, I'm not sure. Uh, if it smells, it sells. <laughs> that's what I say. Uh, that's what my old poppy used to say anyway. Cool. And there he goes, back to smoking his pipe. Okay. So it sounds like I can catch fish now. Here. Let's just... use The first time using the trash bin, of course. It's gonna do this. There we go. So let's see. Can I... Oh, that was a horrible cast. No, let's just bring that back. There we go. Max cast isn't much different than any other cast. As far as I remember, something will pop up above my head that says that I got something. It'll just take a moment, of course. Do I need bait? Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, so right now it's giving me a tutorial on how to fish. Basically, keep the green bar on the fish, and it'll bring the bar up. There we go. And there's a sardine. And then it sounds like he'll just buy the sardine. Is that, is that right? Yeah, 40 gold. 
there we go. Let's see. Training rod. It's a lot easier than other rods, but can only catch basic fish. Let's see the sardine. Oh, it gives me back energy. I see. So I can I can take the fish back from him. That's interesting. Okay, I never knew that. I don't know if that's a new addition or not. Let's see. So let's just sit here and fish a little bit. I might go into kind of like a more montage kind of thing of me catching the fish. Because it can get quite boring just sitting here fishing. So every fish I catch, I'll just let you know. But for this one, I got a halibut. Another halibut. Ooh, new record. Yay! There is some that you fish up and it's just like there is no use for this. Oh, there's also a treasure. I want the treasure. Come on, just give me the treasure. Don't lose the fish, don't lose the fish. Okay. Oh, I almost lost the fish. There we go. What's this? A heron. That's what I need, isn't it? And the treasure has a geode. Uh, blacksmith can break this open for you. Well, I do know that there is a the blacksmith guy in town. But he's... I haven't visited him yet. Uh, I'll visit him eventually, once I want that geo broken open. A uh, driftwood. Does this have any use? Not trash. Okay. Okay, this fish seems pretty easy. I know at some point there's some like really rare fish that like zip around like crazy. There we go. So there's three herring, and that's the goal, right? Yeah, so I have to just talk to Willy. Let's see, so I can just come behind the desk. There we go. Hey, you succeeded, Bantron. The herring is an exciting catch, don't you think? They're always hiding in the most peculiar places. Well, here's your reward. Congratulations. Did he give it to me? Oh, there we go. So I can just claim it there. Awesome. And then let's just go around the counter and sell all my herring. Okay. So I'm going to call it a day with fishing for now. Now that I've gotten that gold done. Actually, this... What's going on over here? What's this? <laughs> okay, okay. I, I won't question further. Let's see. What's over here? Is there anything I need? Ooh, lost book. You found a lost book. The library collection has expanded. Ooh. Okay. So I'm not going to spend a bunch of time reading all the different things that are in the library, all that. But I will be, like, doing it. Just not, like, on video necessarily. This is, like, a game that's all reading gets quite boring after a while. And I just want to keep doing the fun parts of Stardew Valley on video. Let's see. So I know that if there's people around, like, you can dig in the trash cans. But if there's people around, they don't like it when you dig in the trash. So, a lot of the time, it's not a good idea. Let's see. Yeah, let's just drink the Joja. I hate having, like, no inventory space. As I get a little bit more money, I am able to upgrade my inventory, which I cannot wait for. Like, how much is the backpack? I'm pretty sure it's Pierre that sells it. Let's see. Pierre. Um, backpack. Which is it? 2,000 gold. Yeah, I don't have that. Ooh. There's people here. The who of these have I not met? Who's this? Jody. I don't think I've met Jody. Oh, aren't you aren't you exactly how I imagined? Oh, I I see. So she's saying I'm not exactly how she imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. Um ugh. Breathe in. Ugh. Breathe out. <laughs> Wonder if she'll just get annoyed with me after a while. That's like wow. She is very patient. Okay. See this one. Emily. Oh, I can read it on your face. You're gonna love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Okay. See, I've met Caroline. Let's see, 
What's in here? Altar of Yoba. Yaba? Yoba? I am not sure which. <laughs> I'm gonna go with Yoba. Yoba. Yeah, that's fun to say. Yeah, so let's head back to the... Actually, let's see. What time is the blacksmith open until... Does it say that on the map? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, blacksmith. Uh, until four. Oh, I have half hour to get there. Run, 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 run. If I can just get in the door before they close, I'll be good. Yeah, I gotta try to get a horse as fast as I can. You're able to get horses that let you move faster through the game. Like, physically move faster. Which I need. Let's see. Am I able to talk to him? Um, Clint. Uh, hi. I'm Clint. Uh, I'm the town blacksmith. If you ever need an upgrade to your tools, I'm your guy. Okay. Can I have a geode broken open, please? Or do I... Oh, do I go over here? Um... Do I have to go somewhere to have it open? It's a professional grade furnace. Okay. There's a stack of metalworking blueprints. How do I get the geode open? It's full of soot. Okay. Um. Can I? Oh, there we go. Shop? What's, what does he sell? Oh, different ores. I see. Oh, those are expensive. Never mind. Um, process geodes. There we go. Ooh. Purified slime. And that's all museum stuff. The museum is right down here. And it is still open. Awesome. It'll load. There we go. He doesn't look happy. Uh, Gunther. Um, uh, abysmal. Not a single piece in the entire collection. <laughs> he jumped high? <laughs> he jumped like as high as the shell. What's this? You found something? Let me see it. Remarkable. It's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail, but it's yours. Hmm. <laughs> I've got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? We could make groundbreaking discoveries together. Oh, and who knows? If you kept donating, you might come across some interesting items to send your... I might come across some interesting items to send your way. Basically, I'll give you rewards if you give stuff to me. Think about it, will you? If you decide to donate, just bring the objects to the front desk. There we go. So, starting with this. So, let's go up to him and donate to the museum. This. Oh, we get to choose where it goes. Oh. Okay, I think we can keep rarer stuff over here. I know that these aren't that rare. See, I'm gonna put this here. And this here. There we go. So now if I go over... What's this? Whoa! 250 gold. For finding stuff for the museum. Awesome! Now if I go over here... I can, I, I can see what this stuff is. Okay, awesome. And there was also book. Let's see. So there's books right here. Come on. The book is there's a book missing here. How do I see the books that I have? There we go. This is a book by Marie, uh, talking about animals, how they like to be pet every day and let outside. Okay. Um, how do I get to this book? Let me, let me, let me at the book. Okay. Okay. 
I see. I, I can't. I'll, I'll look at that one eventually, once it lets me. Okay. Oh, just gonna run around town a little bit, just meet a few more people. Oh, Sam. I don't think I've met Sam yet, actually. Awesome. Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. And that's all that he has to say. I forgot that you could maybe find stuff in bushes. Like, no bush is innocent. It's locked. Of course the sewer's locked. I'm pretty sure that later in the game there's a way to get into the sewer, but I'm not 100% sure how to do that. It, yeah, I don't... Yeah, I'm trying to think. I don't remember how to get into the sewer. See, ooh, up here there's a leak. My head's leaking! There's a leak on my head! It's not, that doesn't work as well. Here, if I... Oh, can I not throw out my watering can? Darn it, okay. Let's see. Let's sell the leek, the mussel, and the oyster. And I can plant two, three, four, five potato seeds. There we go. Yeah, at some point I will be doing more work on the farm. I'm just kind of waiting until I have a little bit better gear and just like a little bit more stuff. So I'm not spending a bunch of time just like sitting on the farm just hacking at trees like this. Like, am I able to make a chest? Is that 50 wood? Okay. That's going to be my goal for this video, is make a chest. That's not annoying at all. Um, okay. <laughs> Let's cut down this tree. Oh, my energy is starting to go down quite a bit. Every hit is taking down two energy. There we go. 46. 50. There we go. I don't believe I need to be at any, like, special spot to make it. Yeah, I can just craft it. There we go. Nice chest. Now the oh, I can't put it on my patio. That's sad. Let's see, I'm just gonna put it right here. Oh yeah, you can color the chest as well. Um, let's make the let's just keep this one as brown. I don't really have much to put in the chest. I guess I'll put my sap and my fiber in there. Ooh, I can put tools in there. Awesome. Yeah, I don't wanna forget where many of these tools are. I'm going to be trying to stay as organized as I can, but it gets rather difficult. Yeah, and with that, that is going to be the end of the second episode. I am really enjoying this game so far, and I really hope that you are too. Uh, this is a very nice looking game, despite its old graphics. Looks like it was made for like the old consoles. Uh, with me playing it on my gaming computer, it's just like this doesn't seem right, but it's amazing. I love it. So, just gonna go to sleep and end this episode here. And ooh, I got one rod fishing proficiency. Awesome. 160 gold. So yeah, as we start in this series, I'm just going to be doing like one day as one episode. That's about 20 minutes, so it works. As we continue getting further and further along, I'll be cutting it up a lot more. Once stuff stops being as interesting and new, I'll be like uh, doing different things with that, like doing more montages, more like time lapses, stuff like that. But for now, while everything is new in the game, I want to just experience everything raw. So that's, that's why a lot of these videos are just in and go. But yeah, with that, I'm going to be ending this episode. I hope that you're enjoying this series as much as I am right now. And if you have any suggestions, let me know. And I'll see you in the next video.